Steve, one-one draw against Colchester this afternoon. Uh, what were your views on the game? Yeah, uh, gutted to be standing here without the win. Um, obviously, we we're desperate to get the win. I think the players are, are trying their hardest. Um, they're leaving it all out there for the football club, and that's all we can ask. Um, I'm proud of what what they uh, what they put out there today, and um, yeah, just gutted we didn't get the win. And uh, I said we had the we had big enough chances, big enough moments in the game to win it. Um, and yeah, we just yeah. I wish I wish I had I wish I had a um, uh, a different a different answer in terms of like why. But as I said, a clearance off the line, keeper saves a penalty, and yeah, it's just where we are at the minute. Just gonna say we've had these conversations quite a few times over the last month, where it's not been a greatly dissimilar situation, has it? No, and as, as we just have to hold on to the fact that it's performances first, uh, and hopefully the results will come. And uh, I, I wish I wish I could. Um, uh, kind of put my finger on exactly why why the ball's not going in the back of the net um, but as long as we keep creating chances you the old eight the old saying of you need one to go off your backside and it'll go in on it'll it'll start a run and um, you think you might have done that once when how, when Charlie scores but yeah it just wasn't to be it was a great response to conceding such an early goal in a game like this so to get back so quickly yeah the frustrating that's the most I was going to take out the most frustrating thing is how poor the first goal was um, it's so easy for them to score the goal and um, we've got to be better than that and uh, yeah we wasn't uh, but then from that moment on, I thought we um, we stuck to our task. It was, uh, it was a tough, tough, tough to, to play um, the way we'd like to play. Um, today on the pitch, with the week we've had weather wires and stuff, but the groundsman done a great job. And and um, yeah, we gave a good showing. We gave a good showing. If you look up, can't wait for the highlights later. It, um, I might only watch the first first few. Um, but uh, yeah, they said we had the we had the chances. We had the big moments like Craig Clay and. Harry and Harry had one in the first half, and yeah, we just didn't quite get over the line. And the biggest moment of all, ten minutes from time, you must have thought this this was this was the moment, and luck was going to turn. Well, you're hoping it is. You're hoping it is. And as I said, it was. Uh, um, they did it well, to be fair. To be fair, they messed up the penalty spot, and the ref wasn't paying attention. And then uh, the player lays on the floor, pretends he's injured, then gets up. Then Harry's standing there for five minutes, and you've got to give him credit for for being streetwise. Uh, we just wish the officials would take control of the situation a little bit better. Um, and then obviously the goalkeepers guessed the right way. So yeah, credit to uh, the goalkeeper for that. And um, yeah, it wasn't, wasn't meant to be. And uh, pressure, pressure penalty in that situation. You were saying you've, you've taken some as well, so you know how he felt in that moment. Yeah, that's it. But penalties if you're either super confident or you're not, or or you feel like you want to score and you feel like you, you want to take the penalty. And that's how Harry felt. And uh, he'll be gutted now. He's absolutely gutted. And uh, the lads are gutted. And that's what I said to him after. I said, I said, are you disappointed? And they were all got so gutted on the floor in there and uh, that means they, they care. And um, that's all we can ask for, ask them to care, ask them to put their bodies on the line and I think, I th I think they're doing that at the minute. But still, as you say, still fighting, still the same number of points between us and us and Grimsby. Um, two big, big away games coming up this, this week against sides that have both lost today. Yeah, huge, huge games. And uh, as I said, we've been in every single game we've played um, and we keep standing games, we all win one. And uh, yeah, hopefully it starts Tuesday. Hope so as well. We'll see you up at Meadow Lane. Thanks for joining us, Steve. Thanks Thank you. Much. Cheers. Cheers.